Hello welcome on my new video. Today I be talking about malaria vaccine rollout. Before I continue, please subscribe, like and share my channel. Ok let's start. Malaria affects 200 to 400 million people worldwide and causes about 400,000 deaths annually. The most common public health measures include the use of anti-malaria drugs and the use of insecticide treated mosquito nets. These measures have led to a dramatic decrease in malarial cases between 2000 to 2015. But incidences of malaria are still in the increase in some regions despite those measures. Therefore, additional interventions are needed to better control or possibly eliminate the disease. In two parts open label phase 1 clinical trial, safety, tolerability, pharmacokinetics, and protective efficacy of molecular antibody CIS 43 LS were assessed in the healthy adult with no prior malaria infection or vaccination. During two parts of the trial, 25 participants received antibodies at doses of 5, 20, and 40 mg per kilogram body weight to determine pharmacokinetics. During the second part of the trial, controlled human malarial infection plasmodium falciparum infected mosquitoes were administered to 15 participants. Nine received antibodies and six controls. Along with the 15 infection control participants, Protection from malarial infection was achieved in 9 out of 9 who receive antibodies, compared with 1 of 6 controls. During the trial, there were no safety concerns were identified with any dose of CIS 43 LS. 2. Adverse events were mild to moderate, and were resolved without interventions. 3. There were no reactions with the infusion of antibodies. In conclusion, the CIS 43 LS antibody prevents malaria and has no obvious safety concerns. The CIS 43 LS also has broad clinical applications for the control of malaria in a pandemic situation. Thank you for watching my video. See you in next video.